Hey guys, what's up? It's Mossorano3 here, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to record your screen or anything that's on your monitor, or basically anything that you can see on your screen, and uh, make a video out of it for free. So, um, keep in mind this is 100% legal, you don't have to download any third party software or anything like that, so that's actually pretty awesome. You can make gaming videos with this, basically, I don't know, anything you guys want to do, you can do it. So, um, let's get on with the video. Oh, before we do, I just wanted to say be sure to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you aren't already, because I'm on my way to 5,000 subscribers, and all help is appreciated. But other than that, let's get on with the video. So, the first thing that you're going to want to do is open up your web browser, and uh, go to Google, or whatever search engine you use, and type in OBS. Uh, if nothing comes up, just search up Open Broadcaster Software, and go ahead and, go ahead and click the first result. Okay, before I get started with all this stuff, I just want to say that um, you can download this on Mac and Linux. For the tutorial, we're going to be using Windows, but if you guys want, I can make a tutorial on the Mac. Um, there's really no problem with that. I have a MacBook, so uh, if you guys really want that, I can record that and uh, upload that later on. But, so, we're going to download this one. I do use the beta, but um, I don't know. I feel like using the multi-platform one is safer in a way because it's like the proper version, but... Keep in mind to update these regularly, August 9th and August 16th. It's August 18th right now, as you can see down here. So it doesn't really matter. They update these consistently, and you'll be fine either way. So we're just going to download this one for now, and I'm going to save it to my desktop. Alright, so once your download is done, um, it will come up on your desktop. And right here, I'm just going to launch it from here. And it's going to come up and ask you if you want to make changes. Um, I don't know if you guys saw that in my video because my screen's kind of like faded out on both sides. So, yeah. but um, So, it's going to ask you if you can trust the software. Go ahead and hit yeah. From here, all you have to do is hit next, uh, agree, and then uh, install it wherever you want. I'm going to do it to my external, I mean not my external, but my secondary hard drive. My primary is for my operating system and some programs, but um, I'm just going to put OBS on my secondary one. So, um, once that happens, the download should go pretty quickly, and it will give you the option to run OBS multi-platform and then with the version. So we're just going to do that right away for the tutorial. Okay guys, so it did open up just now, and as you can see, it's already trying to record my display. But um, there's a chance that yours might not be doing that, so what we're going to do is get rid of these two on mine, and I'm going to walk you through it from the beginning. So what you want to do is go ahead and add a scene. You can name it literally whatever you want. This is nice for if you want to have like a live stream uh, scene, uh, recording scene, stuff like that. But for this, I'm just going to do YouTube and go ahead and hit OK. From here, you're still going to see a black screen. So what you want to do is add a source. Now this is pretty awesome. You can add audio input captures. You can add uh, webcam, stuff like that. But uh, for game capture, you could record like full screen games, stuff like that. And for window capture, uh, basically the same thing, but it would record a certain window. But for the tutorial, I'm just going to do a display capture, which is literally anything that was on my display. So I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. And it's going to ask you what display you want to use. Since I have two monitors, I am able to pick, but I'm just going to use the first one. And uh, you do also get the option to capture your cursor in the video. As you can see in the little preview, now you can see my cursor. So all you have to do is hit OK. And that's really it. So from here, you can just hit Start Recording or Start Streaming. Um, in the settings, you do have to actually set up your stream uh, key and stuff like that if you're using Twitch or any of these. Um, you can also use a custom stream streaming server, so I'm guessing you would use this if you're a partner on MLG.TV. But yeah, so um, I can make a video on some settings if you guys really want me to. My settings are pretty basic. Uh, they're not like amazing and stuff like that, but I mean, I kind of just pan through them. So I guess you could pause through and make sure you got some decent settings going on on your screen. And uh, yeah, so that's really it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please be sure to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you aren't already, because I'm on my way to 5,000 subscribers, and all help is appreciated. But other than that, um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.